Yeah. With Sage Herta Klecker, winner of her heat today in the 800. Take us through the race, how to feel out there. Um, you know, it's always hard to run an 800, but I felt pretty controlled. I just wanted to not do the least, but try to conserve energy and just always be waiting and waiting. And it was starting to get a little crowded around 600, so I just wanted to pull away, but you know, always feel like I had another year to go. You've made some major breakthroughs in performance this year. What what do you feel is the main difference in your training compared to what you've been doing in the past? Um, I feel like a lot of what I did in the past is building up to now, and it's more of just a shift in focus from more of a distance-oriented background to less mileage and more focus on speed. So, yeah. Obviously, obviously I'm working well. To watch Joe I'm excited. I'm, I'm not a big fan of watching the 10K. I love the 10K, but, you know, it's a long race to be nervous for. How do you kind of shift your mindset coming from that you know, distance you know, background a little bit more into speed? How do you kind of shift your, your head to be focused? I think, I don't know if it's like skill set or mentality or personality. I feel like the 800 suits me pretty well. I feel like I'm a little bit more of like a fiery personality where if, in the longer races you kind of have to like moderate your emotion a little bit where I feel like the fire can burn hot, like get pumped up and ready to go in the eight. You spent a lot of time in Europe recently yeah. compared to maybe some of the other competitors. What do you think of training out there? You know, obviously doing it before the U.S. Championships rather than just after. Yeah, I I mean, we're at altitude when we're in St. Moritz, and so that's not a change for me. I just like being in the circuit. I feel like I gain confidence from getting to know some of the other international competitors and knowing how I stack up against them. And even today, I think like, okay, what would Natoya Gould do today? You know, like... I can do that. <laughs> what will Coach say after this race today? Okay, good job. Go cool down, recover. <laughs> you didn't have to do his voice. Yeah. <laughs> Congratulations and good luck in the rest of the meet. Yeah, thank you. Go cool down.